The Appalachian Wireless Holiday Sale is going on now. Till the end of the year, visit us in store or reserve online for an unbelievable sale on the hottest devices. We know what you want for the holidays because we are you. We are Appalachian Wireless. With blistering cold temperatures and flash freezing on the way, the Kentucky Transportation Cabinet is gearing up to keep the roads safe for drivers. They have already started the process of topping off their trucks and running the routes to ensure maximum efficiency. With this type of front, this is a little bit different. A lot of the times when we get snow, uh, you know, we have to do things a little different than when we when we have this potential for some flash freezing. So um, when we have temperatures this low, uh, we, we try to pre-treat, uh, you know, and kind of put out some brine on the roads beforehand, but we're getting some uh, rainy conditions on Thursday. So that's really going to sidetrack any efforts that we're going to do with um, pre-treating. So we're not going to get to do as much of that. With the potential for flash freezing, many efforts to de-ice the roads are going to be hindered. Uh, when things get down in the single digits, the temperatures get down in these bitterly cold, uh, you know, single digits, um, all of our products, they, they really lose their effectiveness. And so we're, we're going to be out there, we're going to be monitoring, we're going to do our very best. But, you know, at the same time, people have to know that there's only so much that we can do. And there's only so much, uh, you know, that um, in so much of whether that our de-icing products will work. And in temperatures this low, it's just not, they're just not going to do the job. This go around. It is important that drivers stay vigilant and careful on the roads. It is advised that drivers travel a day early, if at all possible, to avoid icy roads. For updates on road conditions, you can visit the Kentucky Transportation Cabinet District 12 Facebook page. For Mountaintop News, I'm Kelsey Dean.